Now, if you don't know, Riders for Republic now has skating in their game. And I'm going to be honest, I've had a lot of fun riding around the map and doing some tricks. But there was one thing that caught my eye, and that was the Golden Skateboard. Now, in order to get this, you need to complete the final X Games event on Elite Difficulty and finish with 900,000 points. Now, if that wasn't already hard enough, I'm going to try and do this by putting my landing mode set to manual, which I've never used before. Which means instead of landing back on my board after doing a flip automatically, I have to try and perfectly land it manually. Now, I think the other challenges are not necessary, but I want to also get the extra stars for this. So the first thing I have to do is collect the skate letters and I also have to take the camera shot. So with that being said, let's do this. Let's go. So I have to go down this ramp here. Well, there's fire everywhere. <laughs> okay, I see the camera right in front of me. So we grab that. Okay, now I just gotta land this. Make sure I don't stuff this up. Okay, perfect landing. Go up here. Oh, I just missed the S. So yeah, we're gonna get our skate letters. So there's a K up here. Can I grab this? There we go. So that's the K. And I stuffed that one up completely. <laughs> it's all manual, so I have to make sure. Okay, that one worked, but I might be bailing a lot of times. I also have to try and get 900,000 points and I'm not doing well with that either. Okay, I see an E all the way up here. All right, here we go. Got that. There's a ramp here. Maybe another ladder somewhere. Okay, I see the T all the way up there. That is way too high. Uh, yeah, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to reach that. Let me try and do a trick here to see if this works. Okay, I can't even land it. <laughs> Usually the game would adjust it for me, but I'm not gonna worry about tricks right now. I'm just gonna worry about the other objectives. So I've just missed the T. If I had to do this in real life, I don't think that would be possible. This is like way too high. <laughs> I could barely go down a normal ramp. Let's see if we can try and get the S. No, I think it's way too far out. Maybe we have to go teleport back on top of the ramp. I think this, that's the only way to do this. Go up here. Still miss it. I'm just going to backtrack it. This is kind of cheating, but it's the only way I'm going to do this. It's like every time. <laughs> I'm like a few inches off. Come on. Let me just go down. Okay, got to go to the middle. There we go, finally. Uh, what other letters am I missing? I got E, got T. I think I'm missing an A, unless I got it earlier. Let me have a look around. I got 50 seconds. But yeah, this game feels like a mix of Skate and Tony Hawk. Mainly because I can do flicks here. Like, I'm using my left trigger to flick it in a way. I'm not, like, completely flicking it. I'm, like, moving it just, like, down or up. But then when we have to do the tricks on the ramp, you have to, like, hold X and B. Oh, wait, I see it all the way over there. I just... Oh, my God. <laughs> I saw it. I just missed it. Damn it. All right. Well, we're going to have to go for the skate letters again. So we're going to have to do this like three times, maybe. All right. We're going to try this again. Go in the middle. Try and get the S. Oh, first try. Just miss oh, wait. I got it there. That worked. I don't know why it didn't work the first time. I had to backtrack it. So I see the A all the way over here. That's what I missed. So we're going to just go and get this. But yeah, as you can see on the list here, I used to always try and go first. But what I've noticed is the game kind of just rewards you for doing the challenges and not like trying to get as much points as you should. All right, so that's K. So we got S, A, K. I just need T and E. And then maybe we can see how many points we get just by messing around. But like I said, the only issue is this is all manual. So if, even if I do flicks that I need to try and land. I don't know how I'm going to do it properly. Okay, let me try this. If I hold X and then B, I can spin. And if I use... All right, so I can use X to, like, correct my spinning here. Uh, ooh, I don't know how I landed that one. But that's the only way I know how to get points efficiently. Let's get the E. All right, so those are all the skate letters. But all we got to do is just try and do tricks now. And I feel like the best way to do tricks is just doing those spins. But landing them is going to be the only issue. Even like that. <laughs> yeah, so when it comes to this game, I feel like this DLC is has the biggest learning curve, in my opinion, just because it's so unlike the other sport events. Like, usually, in order to do tricks, all you need to do is just press the buttons, like, X or square. But with this one, you actually have to use your, like, joint sticks to, like, flick the board itself. Like I said, it's very different compared to the other sports. Also, another issue I have with this game is the camera. I know I can change my perspective. Like, first person's a nightmare. But with the camera, if I'm doing a trick, I don't know, it just it seems out of place and it's very hard to see where you're going next after a certain period of time. All right, we've got five seconds left. Just land that. What do we want? We're on 200,000 points. So nowhere near the amount that we need, but at least we got two out of the three stars completed. Also, they finished last place. So yeah, I need to try and get second or first place in this. All right, let's try this again. All right, here we go. Third try. Let's get this. So first things first, we're going to go up this rail here. 
Okay, maybe we just miss it. I can't even land this properly. I don't know how I did that. <laughs> Not gonna lie. Uh, let's do some flips. Can I... Yeah, my the landing's the issue. I don't know how many tries this is gonna take me. All right, we'll try and do the rail again. Spin this. There we go. That one worked. Maybe do a spin up here. Land it. <sighs> Every time. I don't know how to correct the landing properly. Okay, so we're nearly on 100,000 points. We just need another 800,000. I don't know how people play this game doing it manually. Like, it's incredibly hard. I've noticed the crowds also stop cheering. They just don't care anymore. I'm so bad at this. Yeah, so I think the whole career with this only took me three hours to complete, which is not long. Well, you have other sports in this game. It's not like just skating, but I feel like they perfected this. Like this actually feels really good. It's just perfect for like waiting for Skate 4 to come out whenever they finish that. Plus you can also like just customize your character, change what board you want. Ooh, okay, just landed that one. But yeah, 250,000 points. We've got 11 seconds left. Not too bad, just not the amount we needed though. I just really want to get this golden skateboard. <laughs> Come on, we're gonna get this. All right, attempt four. I want to try and do something. I was noticing when I was landing on rails, I get stuck sometimes and then I was just constantly getting points. I wonder if I can just, let's just jump this. And if I try and spin the skateboard here, because I'm also increasing on my bonus points. This actually is more useful than trying to do like spins or whatever. It's going to be boring, but <laughs> it's the only way I can do it. All right, so if I get to 50,000 points and I jump off. There we go, we got 100,000. So I could do that for like the whole time. It's the only way I know how to get points now. Because if I try and, you know, do spins, it's just not going to work. The only issue is just the time limit. Because yeah, I got two minutes and if I keep... Wait, why do I have... Zero tricks left. Was it because I just did all this? Oh, that ruins my plan because I just tried to like, <laughs> God damn it. Yeah, even if I try and do more tricks now, I don't get any more points. That's annoying. I guess they stopped that just so people couldn't abuse that system. They like have to do spins. All right, we're going to restart it. So I just checked on Reddit to see what other people were doing. They were all saying just go on these ramps here. So that's going to be the plan. There we go. Oh, I got some bonus points for that. Oh, that's probably why I'm getting more points when we start because the bonus keeps going up. Try and jump up here. Don't know how that was physically possible. Haven't stuffed it up yet. It's a good sign. I, was, I actually thought I was going to stuff it up there. Okay, 150,000 points. This is good. Go down the ramp again. I don't know if I'm going to land this one. I have a bad feeling about this. Oh, no, we're good. We're fine. Land this, come on. There we go. I don't know which trick gives you the most points. That's the only thing I need to figure out. Because there's different combinations you can do with these. If I just hold like say A and A again, that does a flip. And then if I do like A and X, that does like a, a flip but more on, on its side. I don't know if they give me the same amount of points or if it's all different. All right, I got 30 seconds left. I'm just gonna waste all the points. Let's see what we end with. Got four tricks left. Okay, yeah, so we ended with 400,000 again. Ah, this is hard. This is a real hard challenge. All right, we're gonna go to the other side and we're just gonna chill on the ramps here. Yeah, this is easy because I'm just like spinning and I'm trying to correct my landing right now. So like when I get to this point, just try and correct it. Spin up, grab the board, correct it again. So I'm getting 30,000 points just by doing this. I'm not gonna, oh, I just landed that one. It's just not a lot of points though, that's the only problem. But it might be the way to go. I'm finding more success with this compared to just trying to do it normally with the other big ramp. Maybe I can try and do some more spins. Oh, that was good. Yes, I feel like I got the momentum here. So now we're on 25,000 points. We've actually got a lot better now, 450,000 points. This is good. This is the way to go. So now that we figured that out, let's restart it and try it again. So of course, we're gonna go down the mega ramp again because that's the best way to get down. But I'm gonna try and combine both methods. So first one was to do some spins here. And we're gonna try and correct this. Where, where's that board? No, oh, don't worry. Or well, at least we got 30,000 points anyway from that. All right, let's try and head back, Brian, this one. Just to get some extra points there, that was 30,000, that's fine. But yeah, I just need to get into the rhythm of just trying to like work out how I'm going to land the board. Oh no. Oh, I don't know how I did that. Why was it only 5,000 points? My concern is I feel it's just impossible because the amount of time they give you and I'm just, I don't know, I'm now just stuffing up all the tricks again. Oh, I don't know how I landed that one. Yeah, so this time it was only 300,000 points. So not as good as last time, but it's the only way to get this done. So I'm just gonna have to keep grinding it and see if we can try and get this.
Wait, is that it? Did I just get it? Oh my god. <laughs> I'm on 910k. I think I just got it. There we go. Oh, that took like five hours to do. <laughs> is that it? Are we done? Oh, there we go. Finally. <laughs> Oh, we finally got it. I was just spamming buttons. That was the way I figured it out, was just to spam my keys and do different variations of it. And there we go. Golden skateboard now available. All right, this is what it looks like. Look at this. It, it actually fits perfectly with my outfit because it like really contrasts between the blue. Yeah, people say the skateboard feels heavy compared to the other ones. I don't notice the difference, but it does feel good though to finally get this done after five hours. Also, I want to mention, I want to say thank you guys for the support on my last video. It is now, according to my channel, my third most popular video of all time. So I just want to say thank you guys so much for the love and support on that. And there's only one more thing left to do and that is the snapper old board.